July 26th, a fiery crash caused by a car fleeing police and traveling in the wrong direction sends the driver of this semi-truck to University Hospital's burn unit. The semi-truck driver is unconscious and not suspected of doing anything wrong. Even so, Salt Lake City police show up asking for his blood. I'm just a nurse trying to Charge nurse Alex Wubbles says the request for blood isn't allowed under the policy the hospital established with law enforcement. So I'm going to arrest her. While she's calling management, the officer becomes impatient. She's going to jail. She even prints out a copy of the hospital's protocol. The three things that allow us to do that are if you have an electronic warrant, patient consent, or patient under arrest. None of those conditions had been met. I'm just trying to just do the, what I'm supposed to do. That's that's all. After that explanation, and while she's still on the phone with a supervisor. No, we're yeah, done. No, we're no, we're done. You're under arrest. We're going. We're done. The officer makes the arrest for obstructing justice. This is my department, and this is completely unnecessary. Then walk. 20 minutes later, she's released and has never been charged. I just feel betrayed. I feel um, angry. I feel a lot of things, and I feel conf I still am confused. Wubbles reminds that blood is the patient's property. I'm a healthcare worker. I'm a, just the, the only job I have as a nurse is to keep my patients safe. Police say the officer is still on duty, but that Internal Affairs is investigating. It was alarming. Um, immediately after seeing the video, they started an internal affairs investigation to look into what happened. 